my friends, welcome to Jurassic Ridge here in Dino Digs at the Orlando Science Center. My name is Anna and this is Stan Jr. and we're here to talk to you all about dinosaurs. Now, what do we call a scientist who studies dinosaurs? Now, we call scientists who study dinosaurs a paleontologist. Now, you may sometimes hear archaeologist or anthropologist, and those are scientists who study people. Those two terms get, yeah, study me, those terms get confused a lot because they both study things in the past and they sound a bit similar. But paleontologists study things millions of years ago, like Stan Jr., and archaeologists study things that are only a couple hundred to a couple thousand years ago. So we don't see that old with archaeology. Now, what they do have in common, they both tend to dig in the dirt. They will excavate what they find. You got a little dirt there, Stan Jr. Let me go ahead and get that. There we go, much better. Look all nice and clean now. And they will use other types of study. They may use physics, computer models, comparisons to living animals, if you're looking at a dinosaur like Stan, to learn all about things that were in the past. Now, with paleontology, are you usually going to see a dinosaur walking down the street? Are you Stan? Yeah, do you? Yeah, no, not that many. Yeah, you're a bit short, Stan Jr., and a bit poofy. Yeah, dinosaurs are a bit too fluffy or fleshy for that. No, instead, we have to just look at the bones and other types of evidence. So this means not being able to study the real animals. We have a lot of theories. In 10 to 20 years, a lot of information changes. So one thing that's always great to do with dinosaurs, look at the bones and tell us what you see. So we hope you'll join us again as we talk more about our other amazing creatures here in Dino Dicks. I'm Anna and this is Stan Jr. and we hope you have a great rest of your day.